Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Sonic Mania Encore Plus Edition Sonic and Mania the Mania the Mania the Ray the Ray the Mania the Ray the, the Mania the Mania the Mighty. I don't. That, that, is that commentary? I think that's commentary. <laughs> I'm drunk and Dan. How are you doing? Uh, last time we did. If I remember it was the paper press press garden. Whatever it was the 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 one ice level sort of in this game. I really wish Ice Cap Zone was in this game. I know I said that in the last playthrough of this game, but I really wish Ice Cap was in this game. Nope. Let, let's not. Let's let's just agree to never do uh, Green Hill Zone again, and let's just have Ice Cap Zone in every fucking game. Okay, uh, maybe not in every fucking game. No, honestly, if they ever get to make a Mania 2, I really hope they're allowed to just go balls to the wall and do whatever the hell they want, make whatever stages they want. And why are there so many Pazuzu statues in this level? I just realized they look like Pazuzu. Don't say his name out loud or Pazuzu will hear you and come and- Okay, no one's gonna get that unless they play Pathfinder. So I'm going to shut my fucking trap about that. Listen, I've been playing a lot of Pathfinder. Like, I- So I'm actually like in three? Well, okay, one of them's a 5e campaign. I'm in like three different- tabletop campaigns now, which is the most I've ever been in. I mean, two is the most until now. Um, because I'm in uh, one Pathfinder where we're doing oh, was it? We're doing the uh, Adventure Path of Reign of Winter where I'm playing as a monk who has the IQ of eight. You'll get that joke if you play Pathfinder. Um, yeah, her IQ is nothing. <laughs> She's dumb. Sweet girl. Very stupid. Uh, then my other one, we're playing Rise of the Rune Lords, which I've played that one before, but this was a different group of people. And things have been going a lot differently than when we did it, and also the DM that we're playing with has homebrewed parts of it, where the original DM... There are parts he homebrewed, but he mostly went by the books. Um, this is also a lot more roleplay heavy, so like, we're acting out our characters more, which I, I, I kind of prefer that. So combat's all right and all, but I kind of like the whole part where you're just kind of interacting and having the characters yap and talk and interact with NPCs. That's my favorite part about it. Because I'm a dweeb! But, uh... Anyway. Uh, the Rune Lords one, I'm playing as an Arcanus, which I have never been a caster before. I've been a summoner, which is as close as I I've ever been to a caster. And what's kind of funny is, for the parts that were in the game... Uh, when we played it before, when I was trying to play as Summoner and then I ended up switching because our team was just too squishy, it's like the exact opposite with the current group. Um, Maletta, that's my Arcana, she's the only caster. And, uh, well, we had another one, Wesh, but he died. Uh, he was a sorcerer. He fucking, he fucking died. We kind of knew it was coming, but he fucking died. Um else did we have? Uh, no, that was the only one. Because we have a witch who's very... We like this weird witch work kind of dealy. And she's, uh, interesting. Man, I didn't mighty a lot. Let me play Ray. Because Ray can get more hits in. There we go. Since Ray can fly. But, uh... What was it? Yeah, so that group is, uh, what was it? So I, I think I mentioned, so the the Reign of Winter one's a very small group. It's only really me, um, was it, and two other players. It's a really small one. I kind of want to see if we can get more people involved, like more friends of ours. I'm going to ask uh, the DM again if there's anybody who can think of to add to it. But, uh, yeah, Rune Lords is pretty good. There's a good number of us in that one. Oh, uh, let's see. How many people are in that? We have... Okay, I'm the Arcanist. We have a Blood Rager. Uh, was it... Anise is playing a... He's he's basically, as he calls it, a muscle wizard. He ca he punches people and casts in large person on himself. It's uh, interesting. And... Uh, let's see, there's him. Then we have a monk. And I is that everybody, or am I forgetting somebody? I think that's everybody. So, yeah, that's Galvin. Oh, no, wait, yeah, that's everybody. That's everybody. And then, like, a niece or somebody watches and goes, You forgot! 
But uh, I also like the, his, uh, the, the fucking muscle wizard's name, Stormheart. I don't know why, but I just like that name. But, uh, what other things? Oh yeah, the, the 5e. The, in the 5e, I'm a orc barbarian. I've never played 5e before, so I just straight up said, like, hey, can you get just, because what was it? One of the other people dipped out of it, and he's like, yeah, we kind of need one more person to play now. Because originally I was just going to sit in on the campaign, and I was like, alright, if you if you roll me the character, like, you stat him, I'll play tonight. And so, well, he got statted. He's a neutral barbarian named Tor. But, uh... That one we've only had one session of. So, or, I mean, I've only been in one session of it. They've been playing it for a while. I, I've been, um, I'm a new addition. And, uh, Barbarian I haven't played before. I played two Paladins, who, uh, believe it or not, I designed them differently. And I've played a Brawler, a Summoner, and then you already know about the Monk and Arcanist. And mind you, it's a different game, so it's, like, different kind of, um design or like I don't know the word I'm looking for it's still it's different than uh you know when I'm playing uh Pathfinder there are things I like about 5e from the one session I played oh, more than Pathfinder there's things I like more about Pathfinder they both have their pluses and minuses Ray just breaks this fucking segment because he can just be like, nah. Oh yeah, so there used to be a way to get around this, and uh, they fixed it. I saw that in a speed run the other day. You can't do that anymore. Little bastard. Or at least I don't think he can. I could be even trying to do it wrong. Oh yeah, I had to remember to rev it once in order to get it to work. If you rev it twice, he goes too far, and it's going to destroy him. Thank you. Thank you, drive through. Thank you, drive through. Oh, come on! Are you gonna... Come on, spin dash. There you go. Clown you. I mean, I probably could have done that, I think. Oh, wait, no, I think it just knocked something to throw me away. Um, I just glitched out the game. You guys saw that, right? And now I lost Ray, which sucks. I love Ray. Oh, God, I gotta do this whole segment again now, except for with no Ray. So I broke that. Um, hello, uh, Sonic Mania team. Please fix. If a scrub like me can break it. At least I dodged that. Man, I miss Ray already. Because I can get through this shit so much easier with Ray. I miss him. I miss my squirrel boy. Let's try not to break the game again. I've never done that before. Um... Okay, there he is. Okay, uh... No. Uh, are you gonna do it now? No. Either way, I rev too much, it doesn't matter. Oh, come on! Okay, there's one. Kill him. There we go. All right, let's not break it. It must be because I flew and it just broke the cutscene. That's a problem. Well, I don't have Ray, so that's gonna make this actually significantly harder. I might lose a couple characters here. Okay, I'm gonna wait for the arm to go down. Oh fuck, I lost. Oh no! Damn it. Oh god, I've lost Righty and Righty. 
Mighty and Ray. Oh, avoided that. I didn't avoid that though. Hit him, Sonic! Okay. Alright, well, he's dead. And I lost like half my party. So, that's a thing. I lost Sonic. I lost. I lost all my favorite boys. But at least Knuckles got me through. Knock, knock. I think I'll do another stage. That was only 10 minutes. That actually went surprisingly fast. I can't remember. Where does it send me to now? Is that Hydrosity? I think it's Hydrosity. Yeah, it's Hydrosity. Well, Hydrosity is really good. I like Hydrosity in this game. Well, what I'm gonna have to do now is, as soon as I can, I gotta play the fucking pinball game so I can try to get Ray and Mighty back. So, I gotta try and... Can I climb? Is there any hidden secrets? Are there any secrets here for Knuckles? Okay, there's nothing here. I mean, there could have been, but I didn't feel like climbing up there for an entire fucking video, you know? But yeah, I've been, uh... But, yeah, I guess I'm talking about tabletop stuff. I don't think there's really anything else I can really say about the tabletop stuff I've been doing. That's kind of it. I just ran right into that like a fucking idiot. As I've said before to my DM when I made a mistake with, uh... I forgot to take one of my, um, spells for a level. Like, for, like, a level before the current one I'm on. Uh, as I joked with the DM, just because my character has a, um, in score of 20 doesn't mean I have an in score of 20. It true, though. Actually, it was kind of funny. So, just for shits and giggles, I guess, because I was... Kind of got curious, and because I keep all my old character sheets. Even if a character dies, I like to keep them around just to kind of look at them. And also because, of, hey, sometimes if a character dies, and I want to just do them again at some point, I can. Though so far, I've lucked out on the death part. I haven't lost a character yet. Not that that... Not that I want to lose somebody. But, you know, I, I luckily haven't lost anybody yet. Oh, I gotta get the water. Oh yeah, I'm gonna need a bubble, otherwise I'm not gonna... So I'm in a bubble in a bubble, while also a bubble. This makes sense. What do you mean? What do you mean that's stupid? No, it makes total sense. You're just dumb. He flies. But, uh, okay, this is for fun. I'm gonna say... So like I said, I was, I was comparing them and to see like who was better at who like who had a higher stat where. Um, so like I said, I played two paladins, um, a monk, a brawler, an arcanist, and a summoner. Who do you think has the highest charisma? Okay, you you guessed right because you're already gonna guess the paladin. It was actually my second paladin. The 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 no, no it was my first paladin had the highest charisma. The second one. Funny enough, she, uh, she's the daughter of him. The only stat that he had over her was Charisma by one point. Other than that, she overshadowed her father. Kind of, like, immensely. But, uh... Now, to be fair, Nathaniel, my first paladin, he was, uh... Like, my first Pathfinder character ever, so... He holds a special place in my black, crusty heart. But, uh, okay. So, let's try some other ones. Who do you think has the highest intellect? You're probably gonna guess either the Summoner or the Arcanist, and yeah, you're right. The lowest is... Let's see if you can guess the lowest one. If you guess the Monk, yes, she has the lowest intellect. She's stupid. I have not run into one of those, uh, checkpoint boxes. Like, what the fuck? Where are they? Um, let's see here. Highest strength? Uh, who do you think it was? It was the Brawler, which was probably... 
I'm gonna guess someone's guess. I'm not counting a Barbarian because he's in a different edition. Because he's in 5e, not Pathfinder, so it's like kind of hard to compare him to the other ones. Because his points mean different things than theirs do. I mean, I'm sure there's a way to convert him, but I'm lazy. But, uh... It's just so... Okay, so we did them. Uh, Dexterity. I think... If I remember, I think actually the Brawler had the highest dex. Uh, it was either the Brawler or the Summoner. I think Marilyn was just a little bit behind them. The, uh, that's the Monk. Uh, who... What's the next? A con? I don't remember who had the highest con. Um... Now here's something funny. Who do you think has the highest AC? Wow, I never hit a checkpoint box. I'm gonna hit the boss. And I never hit a checkpoint. Jesus Christ, I still don't have Ray and Mighty back. Nah, I don't really wanna switch up who I've got. I'm kinda happy with what I've got. I like that they give you that just in case that you would drown so you don't drown during this damn cutscene. Seriously, I can't believe I missed every checkpoint. I'm- that's kind of impressive! Actually, you know what? Let's be Sonic, because he can jump higher. Uh, but uh- oh yeah, AC was my monk. She had- she has the highest AC- Dude, it was, it's ridiculous, because Brock, uh, was the one who I went through the end of Rune Lords with. So he's like, he ended up being like a level 20 character, and he loses out to the monk, who like, I think she's like level 8 right now? I think she's a level 8. But uh, she just has a ton of decks. She has some decent items to keep her from getting hit. Um, and then she's an unchained monk, by the way, because I'm not stupid. Of course I'm going to play an unchained monk. Why would I not play an unchained monk? Um, she has... Uh, was it a key ability, too, to give her... I think, was it, her AC total is 25, I believe. But if um, I have her use one of her key abilities to summon a bark skin for herself, she goes up to 27. I think she has the highest AC in the party. It's kind of ridiculous. So she's just constantly deflecting blows from people. It's dumb. Um, it's, it's funny, because she's also stupid. See if I can get a fucking checkpoint, because seriously, I need to get my boys back, man. I need my boys back. The boys need to come back to town, man. Oh, okay, I'm going into the water now. Come up out the water. Okay, I'll stop. But, uh, yeah, so that's all I can remember of where people are statted. But yeah, none of them, none of them ever died. Um, there were reasons why I, I switched... Oh, speaking of death... I kept that bubble shield for a long time, too. God, now I gotta get Sonic back, too. This is actually terrifying. <laughs> Alright, let me... see if I can find something up here. I can't believe I've lost, like, all my characters in this fucking playthrough. Or, not this playthrough, this episode. Like, Jesus Christ. I'm just down to Sonic and... Uh, not Sonic, Knuckles and Tails. And I have yet to find Checkpoint. Like, oh my god, there has not been a Checkpoint in a while. I'm like half tempted to switch to my other profile. <laughs> Just so I have people again. Like, oh my god. Hey, continue posts. Or, Checkpoint posts. Those things. Please? I, I want one. Oh, ooh, yes! Okay, now I just have to not fuck up. Haha, <laughs> he said. Okay, so... Let's try to get... Okay, good, I got Mighty. Now I just got to do that three more times. I mean, not three more, two more. Okay, Ray's gonna be the easiest one to grab. Oh, no! The claw went down too quick. Oh, what am I gonna do with a fucking fire shield? That glitched. But I'll take it. Oh, I went a little too aggressive because of that fuck up earlier. Oh, 
no, 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 shit. I don't think I'm gonna get him. Crap. I'm playing like shit! No! Fuck. Well, I got Ray back. Not Ray, I got Mighty back. So I got one boy back. I gotta get two more boys. Ugh. Fucking hell. I'm upset. And yeah, the fire shield's gone because it's useless. Fuck am I gonna do with a fire shield? I almost killed Knuckles! I am getting a little frustrated. I can't believe that's the only checkpoint I've found so far. God damn. But yeah, I can't think of anything other tabletop things to mention. Uh, yeah, there's not really much else other than we're... For those of you who played Rune, yeah, Rune Lords, we're finishing up Thistletop. And, uh... Yeah, was it? Wesh died at Thistletop. He got fucking killed by the bugbear. Because, uh... I'm he Well, actually... Oh, fuck. Shit, shit, shit. I need to get rings back before I hit a checkpoint. Uh, Wesh died to the bugbear because he had the human hunting bow thingy. Or the favored target human. So the bugbear just kind of fucked up his life. And by fucked up his life, I mean murdered him. It sucked. But he, he killed, like, a ton of people before he went out. Like, he did a... Was it he, like, ran up, did uh, burning hands, and then died. It was pretty much how that went. But he killed, like, a large swath of the mooks in the room. I think one of the few survivors was, like, one of the goblin brides. I think that was, like, one of the ones that lived. But yeah, he did a lot. He did, he did fucking work. His sacrifice was not in vain. But God, it sucked. Oh, cool. I can try getting some of the uh, boys back. Okay, let's see. Who can I get? Fire shield again? What was that bullshit? You guys saw that shit, right? Yes, it's keep giving him the fire shield and the water level. You love it. Yes. This is my face right now. Fucking bollocks. Ugh. I just want... I just want my boys back. Is that so much to ask for? Yeah, there goes that fire shield. That so useful fire shield. What's down here? Oh. Oh, god damn it. You! Swing! I always love the Tails' little doggy paddle. It's adorable. Oh yeah, I don't have any fucking rings now. So I can't even try to get some of my boys back. Ugh. This blows chunks. This sucks. This, this sucks. I gotta make sure I hit him consistently, otherwise I'm going to drown. There we go. This is fucking... I I'm quiet because it's like... I don't want to die. Well, Mighty's gonna die. Not that it'll matter, because as long as I'm not controlling him, he'll come back. Let me get that. There we go. I gotta try to avoid death. Easier said than done in this game. At least right now, because I've lost two of my boys. Ah, fuck. I thought I was gonna kill him in one round. That would've been great. Oh, good job, Tails. You did it. You saved Christmas. 
hopefully next episode we can like bring back some of our boys like man we're down like two boys and that's two too many I like how like one stage took like 15 minutes longer than the other one and then we go okay <laughs> they kind of like stalled for a second and then they walked in well that was a transition I guess Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed Sonic Mania. We lost some friends. Hopefully we'll get them back next time. Have a good day. Yeah.